Hey, this is Brett with Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin. And today we are checking out quite possibly one of the best looking Jeep Wranglers we have ever had on our lot. A 2020 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sahara, but it has the high altitude package on it. This one comes with the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor, which pumps out 285 horsepower and uh, gets you 22 miles per gallon on the highway, 19 city, 20 average. Uh, we shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second. So if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, or smartphone device, turn them on right now because it is definitely your best way to check out the looks and styling of the vehicle before seeing it in person. And this is definitely one of the best looking Jeeps I've ever seen. Bright white is the color. And uh, we're gonna go over exactly what that high altitude package is and what it gives you. It's a over $9,000 option on this Jeep. First off, it gives you the 20 inch painted black alloy rims, Bridgestone Dueler HL 275-55 R20 tires. And they definitely have like a highway um, terrain pattern on them. You get the blacked out gloss black Jeep logo, the gloss black um, inserts, the black trail rated badge, black Wrangler unlimited lettering. Notice you get the color matched mirrors, the color matched hard top, the color matched door handles. You also get the color matched fenders. The high altitude package includes the LED lighting group, which gives you the LED headlamps, LED running lights, the LED running lights in the fenders, as well as the LED fog lamps. You also get these gloss black bezels around the fog lamps and the gloss black bezels in the um, grill there as well as around the headlights. Very good looking Jeep. I'm going to take a quick peek at the original window sticker here. Feel free to pause this. You don't have to, I'm not going to go over everything except for what the high altitude package gives you. You get the anti-lock four wheel um, FNC disc brakes, the Dana M210 wide HD tube front axle. You also get the 20 inch rims, the tires, the 8.4 and premium audio group, which gives you the 8.4 nav with Sirius XM traffic and travel link for five years, as well as Sirius XM guardian for a year. You also get the Alpine premium sound system with a subwoofer, Google and Apple CarPlay, um, which is a nice system. The Sirius traffic plus, 4G LTE Wi-Fi hotspot, the nav, the leather trimmed bucket seats, which have this really nice copper stitching to them. And you also get the LED lighting group, safety group, integrated voice command with Bluetooth, leather wrapped parking brake handle and shift knob, remote proximity keyless entry, and the park sense rear park assist system. You also get the cold weather group, which gives you heated seats, heated steering wheel and remote start, eight speed automatic transmission, anti-spin differential, which is a $595 option. And you also get the 3.6 liter e-torque, um, which, which is a 1250 upgrade. For a total MSRP of 54.85, if you wanna see the summit price on this in the upper right hand part of your screen is a link to our website, click that and check us out there. 22 highway, 19 city for an average of 20 miles per gallon, four front crash test rating and three rollover, not rated for the other ones. So we're gonna finish the walk around here. You notice you get the uh, hinges are painted, door handles are painted, that hard top is painted all the way up there. Four wheel disc brakes on here. The rear bumper is painted. The backup parking sensors are also painted as well. You get the tow hook. Here's a better look at one of those rims. Get the gray Jeep logo on there as well, as well as your HD backup camera. Enter and go system, if it's got that little button, you know it's got the proximity enter and go system. Back storage area, there's your front hard top piece case. The Alpine premium audio system gives you the factory subwoofer back here. All the bars are painted as well, color matched to the body. You get four bolts on each side, you get that crushed eggshell finish hard top piece four bolts on each side and then two quick disconnects right here for the electrical and the windshield washer fluid and then they store right there which is pretty neat what I like about the new JL's is they have storage underneath back here 
Um, when you got the subwoofer and the JKs towards the end there, they had the subwoofer in the back and you didn't have any storage. You get door hinge bolts and roof bolt and windshield bolt holders. Your jack tools are underneath there. And these back doors are a lot lighter than the JKs. You also get the uh, little badge for the JL, which gives you overall length and wheelbase, as well as water fording for the two door and the four door. Those doors shut a lot smoother. And now they've got this little plastic guard on here, which I guess will keep your rear bumper looking good so that that uh, tire doesn't drip any dressing on it. You get the uh, fuel door. This is still a normal fuel uh, cap on there, but you get the painted fuel door as well. You also get the blind spot monitoring, heated mirrors, and I'm sure this is where the blind spot monitor sensor is at enter and go system so if you just have the key in your pocket it'll automatically unlock inside the high altitude package gives you these black leather seats with the copper stitching and that copper stitching is on everything it's it's really a, it's on the center console everywhere but really good looking you get the factory floor mats auto headlamps power windows power locks and power mirrors and as we hop inside the vehicle here, you can see you also get the seven inch LCD display, digital spinometer, compass, outside temp, all that good stuff. The leather wrap steering wheel also has that copper stitching, cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, and then all the steering wheels come with the audio controls on the back on most of the Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram vehicles. Anyways, the 8.4 navigation system, um, really nice system also has android auto and apple carplay which i'm going to be doing a video on how to hook up your android auto and use that so click that link in the upper right hand part of the screen that's going to be in this vehicle you also have your climate controls your heated seats and heated steering wheel controls you can check out the backup camera which those backup cameras are hd now super crystal clear those grid lines are dynamic meaning that they're going to turn as you turn the steering wheel and then um, you also have your other apps in here. And the one that I like to point out besides the projection manager is the off-road pages, which I think is pretty cool. So you get your pitch and roll. Obviously I'm on perfectly flat ground right here, but you also have your latitude, longitude, your altitude. Um, you got your accessory gauges here and you also have your drive train, including your steering angle. Um, so as you turn that steering wheel, you can see what angle you're at. And then your transfer case, if you're in two-wheel drive or four-wheel drive or four-wheel drive low, um, that'll change as you switch that. Push button start over here. You got more climate controls if you don't want to use the ones on the screen. More heated seats and heated steering wheel button controls. Start stop capability, stability control. Downhill assist control and your backup parking sensors, you can turn those off. You do get a media center here with an AUX USB and USB-C jack. That's where you hook up your phone for the Android Auto and Apple CarPlay, 4x4 shifter, 8-speed automatic transmission. Notice you get the copper stitching there, copper stitching there. Keyless entry with the remote start, part of that cold weather group was the remote start. Those keys flip out like so. Really nice and heavy-duty key fob. Uh, you definitely know which key you're grabbing when you're reaching in your pocket leather wrapped dash with the copper stitching as well and that copper stitching goes all the way on the top of the dash as well assist and sos buttons in the, up there home link buttons for your garage door security systems lane systems and your auto dimming mirror i am running out of time here so i'm going to show you the back seats real quick they have the same copper stitching as the front seats and the design really good looking they do fold down almost completely flat which is nice if you have to haul a bunch of extra stuff you do get a 115 volt 150 watt plug-in two usbs two USB C's, and these back headrests do stay down when the seat is up for better visibility while driving child safety locks on the back doors and we'll do one more final walk around of the jeep here i would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this hd video you will have gotten a really good idea of the overall looks and styling of the high altitude Sahara package and, um, and some of the options specific to this Jeep. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, 
SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to our website, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left, a link to more Wrangler videos like this one on your right. If you haven't been to our website, on the bottom, a link to this vehicle on our website. Click that, check